Win. It may seem like 14-year-old Marissa Peltier is working on the computer at home, but she's actually in class. Uh, is it okay if I put my homework in my spiral? Yes. Thanks to Sabine Pass School's new robot they've named Robin. Yes, I was hoping they would because they told me about it. I was just really shocked and then I was praying that they would get it. Marissa was diagnosed with cystic fibrosis November of 2013. Recently we went back for a visit and she had uh, aspergillus infection in her lungs and spent another um, three weeks in the hospital. So Dr. Hyatt and Dr. Katori said absolutely no more um, school for now because of the flu season and then everything. Her immune system is compromised, so it would be dangerous for her to go to school. Marissa has been homebound since December. At first, I was kind of sad because I wouldn't be able to see my friends after three weeks or so. But then after a while, I was like, I guess this is what I have to deal with. You know, it's, I can't change it. Until the school brought Robin on the scene almost two weeks ago. I was actually really amazed by how I could just press a few buttons and I'm in class. Marissa can move Robin the robot around, drive through the halls, and she can see and hear everything that's going on in class. Yeah, you just press like the arrow keys, like the up is to go forward, backwards. To raise her hand, she turns on this light. Go ahead, Marissa, what's your question? And TA allows you to get attendance for her, like if she was in the classroom, and it's so good for her to be able to mix with the kids and to be able to be one-on-one -on -one with her teachers. Marissa's mom says it's made all the difference. <laughs> they bring it to the lunchroom where she drives it to the lunchroom and uh, eat lunch with them. So she can sit here, eat lunch, while they sit there and eat lunch. It's really cool. I like it. In Sabine Pass, Lauren Hewitt, Fox 4 News.